Hey Maximizers and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Crystal. I'm a coupon coach and educator with my company, CrystalMaximizer.com. And today I am at CVS and I'm shopping on Sunday because I am Kinsley free. And there's some coupons I want to use at various stores, CVS, Walgreens, Target. Some expire today and there's some Sunday only deals I wanted to do at Walgreens. And I was like, if I'm going to go to Walgreens, I might as well just make a day of it, go couponing. And that way I don't have to go out for the rest of the week which is super nice but I'm at CVS and if this is your first time watching I do provide you with a printable breakdown it's linked in the description box so you can print it out and use it to go shopping anything that's highlighted in pink is a beginner deal so if you're just starting to coupon this week you should be able to do that deal so what do I want to grab at CVS there's really only two deals that I'm after so I want to get the chic razors because I haven't bought razors in probably months so I want to add to my razor stockpile and I should be able to get my razors for or super cheap as long as I have a razor CRT and um, if not worst case I'll be able to pay a dollar 33 for them but going from $5.99 to a dollar is a great price for these razors and I actually like them a lot better than the super cheap razors there is a really awesome pull-ups deal that I want to show you guys if you need pull-ups um, there's a Tampax deal. I had to check to see if they're ringing up buy one, get one 50% off. I saw a savvy coupon shopper talk about that deal, so I wanted to check it out for myself. And then I really want to get Eucerin. I haven't bought Eucerin in a couple months, and I was finally able to print out the $3 off coupon, so I'm going to grab them. And that's pretty much it for what I want to grab. So we're going to walk the aisles, check for clearance, and I'm going to let you guys know what's good this week at CVS. So if you're interested in seeing my CVS haul, then just keep on watching. I just love being in CVS. I'm so much of a CVS nerd. So the first deal we're gonna do is gonna be on Eucerin. Let me show you. Here's the Eucerin deal. Spend 20, get a $10 extra buck. So I always grab 997 Skin Calming. If you haven't used Eucerin before, I love the ones that are medium. We don't like the ones that are too light or too rich. They're too rich or too light. So Skin Calming works great. It's 979. And then down here, because I live in Florida, I always try to put this lotion on when I'm going outside. It is the Daily Hydration with Broad Spectrum, Spectrum SPF. It's $10.79. So grabbing both of them brings our total to $20.58. Now from the Eucerin website, I was able to print $3 off one coupons. Just go to eucerin.com, click on coupons, and you can print them out. So I printed out two of them. And then in my CVS app, because I still haven't used the red box, I really don't need to, honestly, y'all. Um, $2.25 off 10 hand and body CRT. I'm going to go ahead and use that. So after using all those coupons, my total is going to be $12.33 at the register. Going to get back my $10 extra buck. Makes the final cost $2.33 or $1.16 each. Now, usually I can get Eucerin for much cheaper than that, but I usually get $3.50 off coupons. That's another dollar. And then sometimes I get at least a three off 10 or $3.50 off 15. So my coupons are a little less value, but I do wanna just go ahead and grab these two, add them to the stockpile, cause I'm not sure when this deal is gonna come up again. So yeah, I'm just excited to do my favorite deal. I have some various office supplies, pens and pencils and stuff on clearance, 50% off, 50% off. I see some pens, pencils. Uh, when they get to 75% off, like especially those highlighters and they're 75% off, I'll grab some. I did go ahead and grab these push pens for $1.59 because they're super cute and there's only two left. I'm not sure it'll be back. It'll be left next week um, when it goes down a little bit more and they have some post-it notes. So if they go down to 75% off, I'll definitely, definitely indulge. They, oh, is this a label maker? Oh no, that's a calculator. I don't know why I thought it was a label maker, y'all, but then they have this calculator for 364. Um, they have some planners as well. Um, what is this? This is cute. It's five dollars. Oh, this is super cute journal. I don't know if that's the thing that's on sale, but that's super freaking cute. I have to check to see. That's super cute. But all right, check your your store to see if they have anything like that on sale. They have like these little binders on sale too super cute you can use that for a planner binder whatever okay let's keep going oh my store also want to tell you my store still has hi 90 percent off easter clearance left it's like down to the bare bones but check your store your store still may have some they have a lot of peeps you can tell people don't like to eat peeps 
but yeah they still have 90 percent off clearance so let me keep going so i can get my little butt out of here all right we're in the cleaning aisle and paper products so let's see they have all cleaning stuff um there's an all coupon in the retail me not and there's a snuggle coupon so if you need all you can grab it for $1.99 this week at CVS and Walgreens. And I'll link my Walgreens video here for you to check that out. And that $1 coupon, there's a snuggle and an all $1 off coupon. My, my uh, newspaper stopped getting the Retail Me Not. So I don't have Retail Me Not coupons anymore, which kind of sucks, y'all. But I'll figure it out. I'll have to reach out to my coupon fairy. Um, look at this shout. It's two for six. It seems like a decent deal. And we sometimes get shout coupons. And it's included in the spend 20, get five if you need it. Uh, let's see. Okay, paper products. So they're not as stocked as last week, but their restock day is Tuesday, and again, it's Sunday. So they have some toilet paper, and they have paper towels. So it looks like paper towels are going to be, like, here to stay, y'all. They have deals on oh, household items or seasonal toys, and no pet food deals. All right. So I always like to just go down this aisle so we can see what cleaning supplies and household items they have. All right, Maximizers, I'm gonna go ahead and do a razor deal. So I'm gonna grab the uh, Skin to Mint razors. They are on a promo buy three, get a $5 extra buck, and they're $5.99 each. Then I'm gonna grab one of the Skin to Mint shave creams for $2.99. And you know what? I think I might grab this and see if it feels any different. I'm not sure if my coupon's gonna work on this. Eight fluid ounces, and this one is seven so let's go ahead and try this and let me see if my coupon attaches to it okay so i'm gonna grab one of those for 2.99 the way to see now i'm gonna give you guys a trick the way to see if it's gonna attach is we're gonna scan the product so here's the product and so the five off 20 attaches i had that printed out already and then also you can see the one tyler skin to mint attaches so we're gonna go ahead and grab this as our 2.99 product we're gonna put this back so I can try that out. Great way to try a new product. Okay, so that's what we're gonna grab. We're gonna grab three packs of razors. I grabbed two sensitive skin, one raspberry rain, and then we have the coconut silk shave conditioner and cream. So getting all of those will bring our total to $20.96. So for coupons, we have a combination of paper and digital coupons. So on our CVS app, we have $1 for the shave gel, and we have a $3 digital for one of the Sheck razors. And then we have two paper coupons that came out in the 517 Smart Store. So we're gonna use two paper $3 off coupons and we're gonna use the five off 20 CRT. So after using all those coupons, it should bring our total down to $5.96. And oh my goodness, I'm so excited. So after using all of that, we'll get back our $5 extra buck and it's gonna make our final cost just 96 cents or 33 cents for each product. Actually, I lied, 25 cents for each product because we're getting four products. So it's gonna be basically 25 cents per product, which I am here for to get razors and shaving cream. Oh, I'm so excited, I love couponing. I love couponing, I love couponing. Okay, let's keep going. All right, y'all, the music was so loud, I have to voice over this. So this deal is only for people who are beginners, like you've never couponed before, or you are desperately in need of toothpaste and you don't wanna pay full price. The toothpaste is $3.49. And when you buy one, you get a $2 extra buck. We have a 50 cents coupon that came out in the 517 Smart Swords. So you would use that coupon. It would bring your total to $2.99 in the store. You'd pay $2.99. Then you'd get back a $2 extra buck, making your toothpaste 99 cents. Here's the 50 cents coupon that you can use. Now, why is this deal only for beginners? Because typically we can get toothpaste for free at least once or twice per month. But if you're just starting and you want to do a deal, here's the breakdown um, on my printable breakdown. I'm showing you it. And I even put on there that it's just for beginners. So if you're just starting, you want to do your first coupon deal because you've been paying full price for toothpaste, this is a good deal for you. But if you're not in desperate need of toothpaste and you and you don't need it at this moment, I would say wait because I'm pretty sure in the next week or two, we're going to get free toothpaste. But again, it's $3.49, use a $0.50 cents coupon, pay $2.99 at the register, and get back a $2 extra buck, all right? So I just scanned the Tampax Pure and they're not buy one, get one 50% off. So I'm not gonna do that Dr. deal. Frank? I'm going to save those coupons for when they are on sale. And they have some other skin to mint razors I wanna try. I'm gonna ch change out one of my skin to mint razors. Now, but let's go look 
at the baby jail and then that's it y'all and then on my way out I'll show you guys the milk I'm not gonna buy any milk because I'm Kinsley free so I'm not gonna buy any milk right now I have enough to get me through and I'll probably just buy myself a half gallon all right so let me show you the huggies all right, Maximizers, it's time to get our Huggies pull-ups for cheap. We can see the Huggies diapers and pull-ups are spend 20, get a $5 extra buck, and they go on sale two for 20. So for the pull-ups, and it looks like the diapers are also included, but we are going to focus on the pull-ups because there is Ibotta rebates. So grab two packs of pull-ups for $20. I have two in my cart, and I'm going to sell these, y'all. They are two for 20. We have $2 off one manufacturer coupons. They came out... 517 smart source so i have two of them and then also in my cvs app i have a three off 18 baby care crt so we're going to go ahead and use that crt after using all the coupons our total is going to come down to 13 dollars out of pocket so here's the three off 18 so our total is going to come down to 13 dollars out of pocket we're going to get back our five dollar extra buck and then ibotta you can submit to ibotta to get two dollars and fifty cents back per package of pull-ups so let me show you right here here it is two dollars and fifty cents back on 18 counts or larger they are both larger than 18 counts and then down here you can see that it's good at cvs and you can also see that it's good for up to five per receipt and then this is earn one dollar when you redeem huggies pull-ups offer three or more times on separate shopping trips so between now and october if you buy Huggies uh, pull-ups at least three times you'll get an additional dollar from Ibotta So if you're not signed up for Ibotta my link is in the description box So after we get back five dollar extra buck five dollars from Ibotta our final cost is gonna be three dollars or a dollar and fifty cents per pack and I'm gonna flip these and I'm going to sell them Locally, so I don't so the person doesn't have to pay for shipping and it makes it worth their while So I'm gonna go ahead and sell these and I have two other packs at home that I'm probably gonna sell too. So yeah, absolutely. Pull-ups for $1.50 each. So if you're a mom out there, definitely check your CVS account. See if you have the the diaper or training pants CRT. Stack it up. Submit to Ibotta and get you some pull-ups for as low as $1.50 per pack. If you need milk, you buy a gallon for $4.29 and you get a $2 extra buck back. So in the end, your milk will just be $2.29, which is a great, great deal if you need milk, okay? Alrighty, maximizers here is our haul okay so now let me explain to you guys what i'm gonna do i have my transaction breakdown here it's linked in the description box you can use it print it out it allows me to know how much of the cent i'm gonna pay before tax at the register i'm doing three transactions because i only have three dollars in extra bucks to roll and i want to get the lowest out of pocket possible so i'm gonna show you what you can do when you have limited funds or you have no extra bucks to roll to lower your out-of-pocket. I'm going to do the transaction first that's going to give me the most extra bucks back. So we're going to do Usurin. Usurin is spend 20, get 10. We're going to get the two for 20, 58. We have our coupons. We have the two $3 off printables I showed you. And then we have the $2.25 off 10 CRT. It's going to bring our total to $12.33. We're going to roll the $3 in extra bucks that I do have, which are right here. And then that's going to lead me to pay $9.33 plus tax at the register. But I'm going to get back a $10 extra buck. Next, we're going to do the Huggies deal. They're two for 20, okay? We're going to use two $2 off one paper coupons. And then we're going to use the three off 18 diaper CRT. After using all those coupons, and I write out every coupon here, our total is going to be $13, okay, after we get our $7 off. What are we going to roll? We're going to roll that $10 extra buck from transaction number one. So in real time, I'm going to cut it off my receipt, and I'm going to use it for transaction number two. That's going to lead me to pay $3 plus tax, and I'm going to get a $5 extra buck back, okay? Then we're gonna do all of our razors, our three razors, and we're gonna get those push pins, which are under here, the $1 and something, something push pins. Our total is $22.55, but what coupons do we have? We have two of the $3 off razor coupons. We have the five off 20 CRT. And then in our CVS app, my phone timed out. We have one $3 skin to mint coupon for, okay, we have a $3 for the razors. And we have $1 for the shave gel, okay? You see that? 
So we're gonna use all of those coupons and our total is gonna come out to $7.55 after all of our coupons. We're gonna roll that $5 extra buck from transaction number two and our out of pocket is gonna be $2.55. And we're gonna get a $5 extra buck back. So at the end of the day, I'm only gonna walk out of the store with the $5 extra buck, but my out of pocket is nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, $15 plus tax. So if you only have 15 to $20 at CVS, you can come in cash out of pocket and get all of these things with just simply rolling your extra bucks that you're gonna receive. Does that make sense? So this is what I'm gonna be doing for weeks to come as I continue to build back up my extra bucks. So I'm only gonna have $5 to start next week, but it's better than nothing, right? I think I have like a dollar left in gift cards. I'm gonna use that today as well. So this is us, we're gonna go to the, um, so this is all, I'm gonna go to the register and I'll see y'all when we get back home to let you know if everything went as planned, all right? As I'm walking out, I see that I get a case of water, the just the basics for just $2.77, which is freaking awesome, y'all. So if you need cases of water, then I would say definitely check out your local CVS. Everything at CVS went great. One of my favorite cashiers was there. Everything went perfect. One of my favorite managers, two of my favorite managers, went great. Today, CVS was perfect. So now I'm going to, I have one more store. I actually have two more stores to go to today, but I'll see you guys when I get back home. But I'm just so happy. I love couponing. And I found out that to, even though Tuesday's restock day, y'all, unless I'm hunting for like those high, uh, hard to get items, I'm going to probably move back to going shopping on Sundays simply because my favorite cashiers are here and it just makes for a much better experience. The store was not crowded at all. So, yeah, I'm so freaking excited. I can't wait to get back home and tell you guys more. All right, Maximizers, we are back home from CVS and this is our haul. So I'm going to go through each transaction and tell you how it went. And it worked fine. Like I told you guys when I left the store, one of my favorite cashiers was there. We were chatting it up and everything went according to plan. So transaction number one, we did the userin. Everything worked out as planned. Here's the receipt. Okay, so we did the two userins. All the coupons came off. Okay, so my $3 in extra bucks, my $2.25 um, CRT, and my two paper coupons. My total was $9.33 as expected. We paid $10.48 with tax, and then I got the $10 extra buck. Then I used that $10 extra buck. You can see my cashier was like, dude, she even asked me, do you want to use that $10 for the next transaction? I said yes. She didn't even give me a chance to get my, my scissors out, y'all. She just ripped it off and held it behind the counter for me for transaction number two, which we did with the Huggies pull-ups, all right? So with the pull-ups, we got them. They were two for 20. All of our coupons came off. So we had two um, $2 manufacturer coupons, the three off 18 diapers, and then the $10 extra buck. Our total was $3 plus tax, like we expected. So after our extra buck, we paid $4.28. And what did I do? I did the same thing. We cut off the $5 extra buck to pay for the razors, which turned out to be an amazing transaction, y'all. Everything came out just as expected. So we got all of the skin to mint razors and then we got the skin to mint shave cream and skin conditioner and then the pins, the push pins right here, we got those as well. So all of our coupons came off, two paper coupons, one digital, the edge and skin to mint digital came off, the five off 20 and then the $5 extra buck from the previous transaction. Our subtotal was 255 plus tax at the register. And we end the day with a $5 extra buck. Plus I have tons of CRTs here. I have CRTs over here. I have a bunch of CRTs, all right? So I left the, the store with a $5 extra buck to roll for next week. So again, I'm gonna re repeat myself. That is how you roll extra bucks and use them to lower your out-of-pocket when you have a small budget. So my cash out-of-pocket for all of this was less than $20. I think it was around like $17 and some change, okay? So I paid $17 and I got all of this. Razors, pull-ups, and lotion, all right? Those are high-priced items. So if you have a small budget, you just have to break up your transactions, cut your extra bucks off in the store, and use them for the next transaction. Now, one thing I got, you guys are like, Krista, what is this? A total impulse buy. So I was in the aisle doing my, my tally up, and I found... I, first off, I love caramel popcorn. I love caramel popcorn with peanuts. This is caramel popcorn with almond and almonds and pecans. It was on sale for $2.99. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to try it. Okay, so I got that one. Then I also love cashews. So here is caramel popcorn 
with cashews in it what so i grabbed both of them and i just paid out of pocket impulse buy luckily they were on sale so they were $2.99 i paid $5.98 and no i didn't use any extra bucks or anything towards it and i did get more of my crts printed which works for me so i don't have to print them from the red box so overall today i'm happy with what i spent this is like couponing stuff i'm definitely gonna take this from my grocery budget because that was a total grocery impulse buy but i'm so happy and grateful for couponing and i'm so happy that i'm able to show you guys what it's like to not have a lot of extra bucks and still not pay a lot out of pocket all right so do the transaction that gives you the most extra bucks first and then just keep on rolling un until you leave and hopefully you get to leave with at least you know two to five or ten extra bucks for next week and we're gonna keep doing it this way y'all until i build back up my extra bucks okay right now i'm gonna show you how i'm gonna submit to ibotta for my huggies rebate so that we can get these for a dollar fifty cents and the pull-ups are gonna come out to a dollar fifty cents each the userine comes out to a dollar and thirty cents each um these were a dollar fifty something these razors come out to 25 cents each after we got back our extra buck and such okay so now let me show you what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go over here i'm gonna open up ibotta move my receipt out the way then we are gonna go to redeem and we're gonna choose our store which is cvs and then it's gonna ask me to take a photo of my receipt from the 10th through the 17th so we're gonna take a picture of my receipt which you click continue and then here's the receipt hold on sorry i'm gonna try to show you guys okay so i took a picture of my receipt i'm gonna hit finish and my phone's not cracked y'all that's just the screen protective aspect and then it's asking me for what i'm going to do so i'm gonna do two of the huggies i'm gonna click two and it's gonna ask me to scan the barcodes all right so then we're gonna get the barcodes of the huggies face up and we're gonna scan it bam we're gonna scan it bam and now they're both in and then we're going to just click add to offers and it says we're going to get that back so we're going to collect five dollars perfect so we're going to get our five dollars to our account so if you're not signed up for ibotta click the link in the description box sign up for ibotta um and i think you get five dollars when you sign up and do your first your first rebate but now we're gonna have pull-ups for just a dollar fifty cents and it usually doesn't take the whole 24 hours to get our money back actually they might have gave it to me that quick let's see so right here you can see that it says that i'm pending so when it pops up i'll have the five dollars back in my account so it's that simple. So make sure you redeem your rebate to Ibotta. If you guys have any questions, please comment those down below. i like to thank you guys so much for all of your support. If you could watch a video or two and let the ads play through, I would really appreciate it. Right now, go check out my Walgreens haul video. I'm going to pop it up on the screen. Please go check it out. On Sunday, I was able to get Priscilla for just 99 cents. So let me know if you were able to get the Priscilla as well over at Walgreens. Okay, sure. you guys go ahead and click the link in the description box and get on the email list so you can stay up to date with all things Krista Maximizer. And as always, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.